Hello and welcome to a new video tutorial of SiteGround. My name is Mauricio Helves and today I will show you how to configure your WordPress to send emails through your website. Let's begin. One of the possible reasons you are not able to send emails using your WordPress website could be a misconfiguration between your SMTP settings in SiteTools and your WordPress. In this video, I will show you how to set up these values using SiteTools and an SMTP plugin for WordPress. Configuration in SiteTools. First of all, let's create a new email account. To do that, go to your SiteTools and then click the Accounts link under the Email menu. Specify a name for your new email account in the Create New Email Account form and then generate a new password and don't forget to write it down because you will need these values in further steps. Click the create button and if everything was ok, you will see a message that your account was created. Also you will see it listed in the manage email accounts area. Go to the actions zone of your email account and click the three points and then select mail configuration. When the dialog box is opened, click the manual settings tab. Here you have all the configuration values you will also need for the next steps. Now go to your WordPress admin area. In this step, you will install a plugin to configure all the SMTP values. To do that, click at the Add New Plugin link in the plugin menu. Search for the plugin WP Mail SMTP, click Install and then activate it. Just a small disclaimer. In this tutorial, I'm using this plugin to solve the problem, but feel free to use any other plugin you prefer that has the same functionality. Now, let's continue configuring the SMTP values. Go to the WP Mail SMTP settings and set the From Email field with the email address you just created in the previous step. In the Mailer zone, select the Other SMTP option. A new field will appear at the bottom of the page. In the SMTP host, Set the outgoing server shown in your email account settings in SiteTools. In the encryption zone, select the SSL option and make sure that the port is set to 465. Finally, in the username and password, set the new email account with the password you created in SiteTools. Click on the Save Setting buttons and now let's run a test to make sure that everything is working correctly. Click the Email Test tab set another email address of yours and then click send email. If everything is well configured, you should receive the test email in a couple of seconds. I hope this video helped you to solve the problem. If so, consider subscribing to our channel to learn more about our tools and much more content we have prepared for you. Thank you and good luck.